To create a commitment letter in Link Lender, we will first add some conditions. Click Conditions from the left-hand sidebar, and you can add conditions one at a time by clicking Add Condition. Double-click next to any condition to add. Make sure it says Yes, and clicking OK will apply each one to this particular application. To add groups of conditions called templates, click the Add Template button. And if any previously created templates exist, you may select them by double clicking. So it says yes and clicking OK. For any help on managing your conditions and templates, please refer to our conditions and templates video. Now that I have all of my required conditions on this file, I will go through and make any edits to the conditions that show up in bold. Conditions that are not in bold text are not editable. Click Edit Conditions. Here is the short list of every condition that has edits available. Some conditions do not require specific inputs, but I could change the text to suit this particular application. Other conditions have required fields that you must complete before you can move on. To identify these really quickly, you can click Next, which will highlight the exact spot that you need to fill in based on that particular condition. Scroll through any of the editable conditions and click Next to quickly highlight all of the areas that are required. Click OK when you are finished. If you make a mistake or you would like to delete any conditions that are not required, you may double click so that they say yes. And you may delete the selected conditions using this button here or delete the entire suite of conditions and start all over again by clicking delete all. Clicking OK will save your changes and later on as conditions start to be collected from your agent, you may come down here and mark conditions as being accepted, unacceptable, or waived. Now that you have added your conditions, you can create your commitment letter. Commitment letters can be created using our boilerplate commitment letter or our custom lender commitment. If you choose the custom commitment, you are able to add or remove different options from the header, from the approval message, decide the order that you would like different fields to appear by moving up or moving down, deleting or adding. And you can decide the order that you would like each condition to appear. For example, I would like my property conditions to appear ahead of my income conditions. You may change the authorization message. You may also change the acceptance message, any instructions and closing simply by removing the tick box and adding your custom messaging instead. Click the generate button to create your commitment. Any changes you make to this customization will be saved for next time. To view your custom commitment or to generate our boilerplate default commitment letter, click Documents. Here is my custom lender commitment, which I can view and open the PDF. If I notice any fields were missed, I can go back and make corrections to my conditions and then I can regenerate the form to pick up any changes. When you are satisfied with the commitment letter, be sure to click the Grant button 
so that when you send it to the agent, they will be able to have access to it. To generate our default commitment letter that is not customized, generate and lender commitment letter. Click the generate button and you can see the difference between the custom commitment letter and our regular lender commitment letter. If I'm ready to send this commitment letter to my agent, I will follow the regular approval process. Application summary, click approve, click OK, enter a commitment expiry date, enter comments, and click send, not OK. Thanks for watching. Please look for our phone numbers at newton.ca if you need any help from our customer care team.